here we are coming to you live from my car. It's been a busy day of donor visits, uh, out and about, grinding hard, raising the dollars, getting the job done. Uh, so I want to show you one thing while I'm in the car, uh, one little trick. Uh, we're going to be talking again today about thank you notes. Uh, so here we go. Stay tuned. We're going to dig right in. Notes. You got to do them after a donor visit, after an important meeting. You got to send that. Show that you you appreciate them spending the time with you. But how do you remember to actually do them? Uh, we've talked before about my three-minute formula to get them done quick. But how do you even still find that three minutes, or more importantly, remember to actually do it? Well, we're in my car today because I want to show you my trick. Uh, before I go into a donor meeting, I get everything all laid out on my passenger side seat. Uh, I have my envelopes pre-stamped, my business cards together, they're stuffed, they're ready to go. Uh, so when I get back out to my car after my donor meeting, it's right there. It reminds me, hey, I need to write a thank you note. Uh, so I quickly scrawl it, um, you know, take my three minutes to get that done, uh, stuff it, it's all set, the stamp's already on, I do that when I put them in my bag, it's ready to go. So it never even gets on my list, and then when I'm walking into my house or my office, uh, when I get... To where I'm supposed to go, uh, I simply drop it in the mail. It never gets on a to-do list. It kind of goes on autopilot. That's how I put my thank you notes on autopilot. Find out what works for you. Pull some of those tips. Uh, make sure that keeps happening. Thank you for the work you do. Thank you for fundraising for our communities. Thank you for inspiring donors uh, to really make an impact. You're awesome. I love you guys. Hit the subscribe button. Uh, show me some love, and we'll see you next week for the productive fundraising weekend journey. Take care.